Hi everybody and welcome back to Cook and Share. It is the holiday season and today on this episode we're doing up one of my favorite holiday recipes, bacon and mushroom carbonara. This is different from other carbonara recipes so I'm in no way claiming that it's authentic. But it's my family's way of doing it. I think you're going to enjoy it. So let's get started. What I have here is a pot of salted boiling water. So I'll put the spaghetti in and cook it according to package instructions. In the meantime, I'm going to add a little bit of olive oil to a preheated pan. Then I'm going to add the bacon, and if you don't like bacon, you can use ham. And I'm just going to stir and cook this, oh, I'd say for about three or four minutes, just to the point where it gets light brown. You don't want it too crispy. Now that our bacon is nicely done, I'm going to add in the onions, garlic, the button mushrooms, ground black pepper, and I'm going to stir and saute these just until the mushrooms begin to turn translucent. This should take, I'd say, oh, three or four minutes. One thing you may have noticed is that I didn't use salt. You can use it if you want, but I find the bacon makes it salty enough. Next, what I'm going to do is add in the heavy cream. the milk. We'll give it a stir and bring it to a boil over medium heat. After a boil, I'll add in the frozen peas, some chopped parsley. Now that the pasta is al dente, we're going to add it in. I'm going to take a couple of wooden spoons here and toss the pasta just so it's nicely covered with the sauce. You may have noticed this is pretty rich, but it is the holidays and we're all going to diet in the new year for two weeks. Then we're going to sprinkle the Parmesan cheese over the top. You can use your favorite cheese, it's totally your call. And we'll give this one more toss, oh, for just about a minute, just to make sure everything is well combined. Now I'm going to turn off the heat and slightly beat the egg yolk, add it into the pasta, Give it one final toss. Now this is really different from other carbonara recipes, but it really works nicely. So at this point in time, you're ready to serve. So there you have it, our creamy, rich, incredibly delicious bacon and mushroom carbonara. Great for any holiday. Sprinkle your favorite cheese over the top and serve it up with a side order of garlic bread. So that was our bacon and mushroom carbonara. Incredibly easy, super delicious. Head on over to cookandshare.com for more simple recipes and remember to click subscribe and like our videos. Happy holidays and see you next time.